In this video, I'd like to share a quick tip that can allow you to convert data that's not very well laid out into some data that pivot tables can use. So in the example here, we have a state listed, but it's not copied down. Okay, the same with uh, Victoria and New South Wales. So we need these uh, blank cells here to be populated with the value from above. Now, what I wanted to do was show you how you can do that manually just using a couple of Excel techniques. So let's make a start. So I'm going to click the start. Uh, I'm going to select the range that's involved. So in this case, A2 down to A17. I'm going to press my F5 function key. And there's a little button called special. And what we want is blanks. So click on that, click OK. Now what you need to do is identify the current cell, the active cell, which is A3. So we're going to type a formula in here that says equals A2. So that's the cell above the cell that you want. What we're going to do then is going to hold the control key down and hit enter. And so that populates all of those blank cells with a formula that refers to the cell above. Now we can't leave it like that. So what we're going to do is select that range again, right click, copy, right click, paste values, and we're done. Cool. And so that is a quick way to do it. That will work even on a very long list, uh, providing that structure is the same, where you need to basically link to or create entries in there that relate to the cell above it. And using the F5 blanks, make sure that you're only selecting the blank cells in the range. Hope you found that useful. Thanks for watching.